What's up everyone? So I'm going to try and film a what I eat in a day video today because it's been highly requested and um, I hate filming these videos because my diet and appetite is just kind of off and random. I'm not really a meal person. I'm much more of a snacker. So I just grab little things here and there every hour, a couple hours um, and he just kind of annoying to film um, and I've been dealing with a lot of nausea so my diet's just kind of weird at the moment but um, I just got up a little bit ago it's almost 11 and I'm starting off my morning with some detox tea um, and I also just made some green juice so let me show you that so this is my green juice it's about 16 ounces of kale romaine celery cucumber uh, ginger and cilantro. It's pretty much what I put in my juice every time I make green juice. Um, so I'm going to drink that and drink my tea. And there's some stuff I need to get done today. We'll see if I have the energy to do it. Like I want to film some YouTube videos. I want to go to Target because I need some stuff. I need to run some errands. Um, so if I do get around to that, I will try and remember to take you along with me. And I'll try and remember to film whatever I eat. Uh, we'll see how this goes. So I'll see you at my next meal or whatever so i couldn't finish my juice because it was just making me feel nauseous so i put it in the fridge for later um and i'm just having it's like an hour and a half later like 12 30 ish i'm just having a couple bites of this leftover chicken because i'm kind of hungry but i don't know what i want i might end up making a meal but that's what i'm having for now it's sunday so i don't have really treatment so that's kind of nice and different so i just filmed a youtube video i did not get dressed or anything i put on makeup because i just don't care and then i'm taking a summer spanish class so i just was studying some of my spanish um try and improve on that and uh now i am just doing some not really meal prep but like Organizing some of the groceries I bought yesterday, cutting up the meat and putting it in the freezer. That's chicken. Um, I'm just figuring out what I'm going to do with my day. So I just warmed up half a Siete Foods um, coconut flour tortilla with some greens from our neighbor's garden and a little bit of that leftover chicken I just cut up just for a little snack before I do some more stuff for the day. Honestly, just trying to make this video super real and raw um about like what my day looks like i don't get dressed i don't put on makeup even for the youtube videos and i eat like really random shit so hopefully this is like useful or interesting in some way too so i finally got myself dressed and i am going to go to target and run some errands um i'm really tired per usual but i need to get out of the house i need to get this stuff done before i move so i'm going to go and try to do that um, and yeah, then I'll have all tonight and tomorrow to rest pretty much because I don't have really anything going on. So I just got home from Target and I want a little snack. I survived the Target. <laughs> it's really hot today. Um, I'm just having some plantain chips. I got these at Sprouts. They're not my favorite because they're fried in palm oil. I really like the Terra brand because they're in uh, coconut oil, but my grocery store sucks and only sells... The like sweet ones, I don't like the sweet ones, I like the salty ones. And then I just have the fresh ground almond butter from Whole Foods. So I have like a handful of plantain chips. And I dip them in here. This is hard to do with one hand. I usually make like a sandwich and then I eat it. It's like three o'clock, these are hitting the spot for a little afternoon snack. Um, I usually eat way too much almond butter, but it's my fave, so I don't really care. So this hasn't been making me nauseous. So we'll see how this goes. And since this isn't everything I eat in a day video, and I'm just being real and raw and honest with you guys, I'm also having um, a cracker sandwich. So I get these Simple Mills original sprouted seed crackers. These are the ingredients. So they're paleo, grain-free, vegan, blah, blah, blah. Um, no garlic or onion, which all the other crackers have, they can't eat. And then I just spread one with some coconut oil. Throw some salt on there, make a cracker sandwich. I'm just having one of these because I just wanted something a little salty and crunchy, but literally I eat the most random shit all day. And I know I eat a lot of like, you guys are probably like, you eat so many carbs and processed stuff for being a limey and whatever. But like, since I've been so nauseous, I just want like crackers um, and carbs. Like that's the only thing I seem to be able to handle. 
Also, I don't really care. Like, fuck you if you are judging me because <laughs> this is what I wanted to eat today. And I'm doing it. Okay, bye. And now I'm going to lay down and take a little nap because that was a lot for me, actually. Um, everything I did this morning. Um, and then I'll do a little bit of detoxing, like a detox bath later today. So I'm going to take my detox bath. I've got some Epsom salts, uh, hydrogen peroxide, and I'm going to put some ground ginger in there for tonight. And then I've got my salt lamp, candle, salt, candle, Himalayan salt candle lit. <laughs> and this is my setup. I also have the water filter on to filter the water that I run for my bath and my computer so that I can watch TV and don't get bored. So I'm gonna do that and then make some dinner and I'll show you guys what I'm having. Are you smiling me, fading into a dark blue? When you even the light can be brighter and dimmer. And the night is right then, and the lights are shining. But no, it can be bright, oh, brighter than the moon. And hear the fear behind and see the side that you could have. Is the only thing that matters when you only see the light. And the night is right then, and the lights are shining. But no, it can be bright, oh, brighter than the moon. The star is far away, doesn't mean you can't shake. Behind the curtains, the moon is still here, ready to appear. And the night is rising. And the lights are shining, but now it's again be bright, they're all brighter than the moon. Brighter than the moon. Brighter than the moon. Brighter than the moon. So this is dinner. I made uh, baby bok choy that I chopped up and sauteed in sesame oil. I added some ground ginger and um, coconut aminos to that. Then I pan fried some uh, crispy salmon bites. I got this idea from Hope Heal Cook on Instagram. She chopped up her salmon and pan fried it just in a little olive oil. I did it in a little olive oil to get it nice and crispy and yummy. And then I made fried plantains, which I don't like to use a lot of oil. I used coconut oil, uh, but I just don't like when they're like super fried in oil when I make them at home anyways, so I use the minimum possible, so they get a little burnt, but I don't mind it, I like it, it gives them a little crispiness on the outside, and soft, gooey sweetness on the inside, and then I put pink Himalayan sea salt on everything, because I love salt, and my blood pressure is low, so I can use salt. <laughs> so I'm going to dig into this, and that's dinner for tonight. So I just made some protein nut butter, inspired by a little oh. sipper, um, I'll link her post below about this, but essentially it's new zest protein mixed with water and I used almond butter. I'm not sure how I feel about it. I might test it out with some of the Terra sweet plantain chips. Um, not my fave, but I think I'd want to try it with the plain new zest. This is vanilla, so it's a little sweet. Um, I think that might taste better. And she uses sunflower seed butter, which I think would be better too, but I don't really tolerate that tummy-wise. So I might snack on this, but I might just save it for later because it's really sweet. So that protein fluff stuff ended up being kind of good and addicting and I kept taking fingerfuls of it. So now I'm just sipping on some peppermint tea uh, to calm my stomach because that was a little much. Um, and I'm sure I'll have a snack a little bit later. I ate dinner around seven. It's eight o'clock now, so probably before bed. I will have a little something Maybe 10 o'clock-ish. I'll show you guys then. So last night I ended up just editing a YouTube video and watching a little TV and relaxing. And then I tried to go to bed a little bit early, but I have not been able to sleep, fall asleep recently. So at about 11 o'clock, I got really hungry. And I got up and I ate a bunch more plantain chips and way too much almond butter, but I'm so addicted. So that's kind of everything I ate and did yesterday in a day in kind of an off treatment Lyme day. Um, I know it wasn't the healthiest eating wise, but with the nausea, I always just want like carbs and starchy stuff like the crackers um, and almond butter always makes me feel better. So um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Give it a thumbs up if you want to see more like it. Let me know in the comments what your favorite food is. I could live off almond butter and plantain chips for the rest of my life and be a happy camper. Um, otherwise, I'll see you in the next video. Have a good one.